end of course test. Listening one. One. I think most people associate community with small towns and villages, but I believe the areas of a city can also foster community identity. So I've divided my future city into distinct neighborhoods, and I've designed each one around a communal space, which has gardens, water features, and a central square. I imagine these areas will be vibrant and full of people. They will be socializing here and organizing all sorts of interesting cultural events and celebrations throughout the year. Two. It's inevitable that the cities of the future will be designed with the environment in mind. For this reason, there are no roads for private vehicles in the center of my city at all. There will be an energy-efficient public transport system with electric buses and trains for commuters, but people will be encouraged to walk or cycle as their primary means of travel. The idea is to create a healthy city, one where the air quality is good and people can be more active in their daily lives. Three. In the future, I hope I'll be living in a city like this. It has technology at the center of the design. We won't have to worry about shopping for food, emptying bins, or heating our homes, because technology will take care of those things for us. Sensors around the city will monitor things like traffic congestion and the flow of people through the streets. If a particular area becomes overcrowded. You'll receive information telling you how to avoid the busy areas. Four. I'm very keen on the zero waste concept, so I've tried to design a zero waste city. The city centre is full of businesses that are dedicated to providing local products that have minimal impact on the environment. You know, shops and supermarkets will be free from plastic packaging, and there's a city-wide food waste program. Which will ensure that waste food from businesses and restaurants is collected and given away, or used to create new products. Five. Tall buildings and high-rise apartment blocks dominate our urban skylines, and I know some people dislike that. But I think we'll need to build high in the future because space will be even more limited than it is today. The idea behind my design is to have tall buildings, but ensure that green spaces are incorporated into them. They'll even have plants and trees on their surface. This will provide habitats for birds and animals, and it'll also prevent the streets from overheating in the summer. So, my city will be densely populated, but also green.